Looking forward, but still remembering the past. Today, the Garner community broke ground on a new high school to replace the aging Garner magnet. Carly Griffith was there when students, both current and former, gathered to reflect on what the school has meant to them. The new Garner Magnet High School will be four stories tall, have more classrooms, more parking, and better technology. But to make it happen, most of the current Garner Magnet will have to be torn down. The school capacity, there's a need there. We've outgrown the capacity here. And the second part is this school is unsafe. There's a lot of problems with the uh, interior and exterior. There's no disputing the need for a new school. But Mayor Ronnie Williams says it still doesn't diminish the sentiment so many have for the place. I've got friends who have friends who have friends who have graduated from this school. And I think they feel like they're losing something. Eddie Gray graduated from Garner High and has taught there for 40 years, inheriting his favorite teacher's classroom. When she retired, I got her classroom. And uh, there's a... There's a sunshine in her classroom that uh, that she left behind, and that's going to be a sad moment when I take the sunshine down. The only high school in town for nearly half a century, students, teachers, and parents will hold their memories tight as they let their building go. This school has had so many generations of the same family walk the same exact hallways, and that, to me, is such a special way to show how close Garner is to people. In Garner, Carly Griffith, CBS North Carolina.